and I'm back with another video. As by the title, you already know what we're doing. We are going to be, y'all are gonna come to the concert with me, okay? It's currently nine in the morning and that is currently because I have to do a lot still. So I have to get in the shower and wash my, because what would I be to go to a concert without a washed ass, you know what I mean? So the concert is not till eight o'clock tonight, but take yourself to work at six. Chloe, stop for you get put out. Chloe, you're about to get put out. I'm not even kidding. My dog's about to get put out with that loud shit. But like I was saying, um, take us off at 8.30. I mean, what? Take us off at 6. Okay, take us off at 6 o'clock. When Tay gets off, we're going to go get him. He's going to come home. He's going to get dressed. Our joints will already be rolled for the concert. Um, I'll be already dressed. Lashes will already be on. You know what I mean? So that way he just got to get dressed. We hop in the whip and we go. You know what I mean? Basically, that's like what I'm trying to do. So, um, yeah, I'm also going to touch up my hair. Just because y'all see how I kind of got like a ponytail look right here. It's because I've been keeping it and I kept it in a ponytail all night to go to sleep. But I did do my hair yesterday. Um, y'all will see that in the last video. Well, y'all won't see me do my hair, but y'all will hear me tell y'all I'm going to do my hair. And then, um, yeah, I'm, I actually have to finish that video. Because, yeah. But also, before I go anywhere, I have to upload my video. So, I uploaded my video last night. But... Somehow, someway, the phone died in the middle of the night, so I never uploaded the video. So this morning, I set it to start uploading, so it's currently uploading right now. It says it has an hour. <sighs> Fingers crossed it uploads. So y'all will get that when it uploads, and then I currently have a thumbnail for that as well. So Tay's at work with the phone, but he can put the thumbnail, and I'll tell him how to put the video on public, because it's currently on private. Um, What else? But yeah this is my hair it's really getting long honestly like i'm not gonna lie it's getting long i'm super excited about that like my hair is getting long it's actually healthy i did not have to do anything to it for it to go straight i washed and conditioned it after that i put it in two braids and then last night i took the time on my day to flutter on it so it took me about two hours to flat iron. And that's because I stopped and took an eating break, ate some dinner. But, um, yeah. Y'all see it. It's very much motherfucking giving. So, as far as wearing my hair. My last concert, I wore it just flat. I'm not trying to do that. So, I'm trying to think of, like, a style. I was thinking about doing something like this, maybe. I don't know, y'all. I'm trying to think of something to wear... I mean, something to do with my hair for the concert. Um, as far as outfits, I still have no clue. Tay said he kind of has an idea. Bitch, I don't even have an idea. So what I'm kind of thinking is wearing a shirt and I kind of want to tie it up and then wear some high-waisted jeans um, and then a jacket. But I don't know if I'm going to feel comfortable because I'm really trying to become more comfortable in my own skin. I used to be very confident, very comfortable. I used to wear bodysuits all the time dresses all the time but then um i don't know after i lost my son i just kind of got like body self-conscious like i didn't like my body anymore i didn't like how i looked in dresses and i had to remind myself girl you're beautiful you're not gonna look like the rest of them skinny barbies and that's just fucking that <laughs> okay so bitch I had to realize that once i realized that kind of got a little bit more comfortable as of why i'm on camera with a tank top on you know any other day I would never, I would never, but this is me, and yeah, that's it. My phone's telling me it's going dead, but um, these are the two options. So this jacket, I already have pictures in it, but like I don't have full body pictures and I never wore it out. I just wore it when I um went with Tay and his son um, trick-or-treating. 
but other than that i have not worn this jacket this one is a brand new jacket i've never wore it i don't even have a picture in it yet it got leather sleeves and then um it's a little cropped it's a cropped look and i'm thinking maybe i have a white shirt that i just ordered so maybe wearing a white t-shirt and some black jeans maybe i don't know the vibes i might tie the the white t-shirt up try to make it look good i can't wear purses because every time i try to wear a purse they always tell me i'm not allowed to take it in the building so i'm not even gonna wear one this time or i would have wore something pink with my pink barbie purse but yeah <clears throat> this is it i usually just put my phone in my pockets i usually just wear some jeans and then yeah we usually get like a little drinky drink while we're there, like a shot of liquor or something. We usually get that while we're there. Last concert, I was too young. This concert, I'm grown, so I can go buy my own liquor and all of that. But I usually don't drink too much at the one on my concerts. I usually just give me a little shot <clears throat> and then smoke like maybe three or four joints while I'm there because it's a, it's a one-time thing, you know what I mean? So the concert I'm going to is the... um legends of the hip-hop or something like that it's got uh juvenile eight ball who else like a whole list of motherfuckers coming i really don't know too many of them but i know like a couple of their songs but tay wants to go so he bought my ticket to go so i'm gonna go and i'm gonna have fun with him because he bought my ticket to go with him because i didn't really know anybody so i just know a couple of people but he was like, I'm going to buy your ticket and you're going to go with me. So he bought my ticket. It was like $161 for in like 30 cent for both of us to go to a concert. So that was cool. But yeah, we, we're trying to go to more concerts this year just to, you know, this is a date. We're going on a date tonight. Nobody's going with us. So we're going on a date. We're going to on a date to a concert. So yeah gave y'all a little inside but i'll see y'all later when i'm like doing my lashes or something because as of right now i'm about to just film the outro for the last for the next video Good morning, you guys. So it's the next day from the concert. I'm getting ready to edit this video super duper fast before Tay has to go to work. But I didn't really record footage yesterday. I just kind of told y'all I was going to get ready and I was going to go. So I'm going to insert a picture of mine and Tay's outfits that we wore. And then I'm going to insert all the clips that Tay has from the concert. And I'm just going to mute them. 
but we had a good time it was a four hour long concert we got there like 7 30 but it didn't start till like 8 and then we didn't even leave until like 12 15 so it was a really long concert not gonna lie but it was fun it was really fun and i definitely would like go back to one of their concerts like their music ain't shitty or nothing so like i, I could vibe we smoked literally five joints we smoked five joints while we were there and we were just really enjoying our each other's company having fun enjoying each other's time it was a lot of fun i'm not gonna lie to y'all so let me turn y'all this way real quick I'm about to give you guys a haul. If I give you guys a haul, I'm gonna edit this video. So, Tay's behind me, y'all. He's sleeping. He ain't even sleeping. He's just relaxing his eyes. But yeah, I think my hair did pretty good. It stayed all night. I just brushed my teeth so that tastes nasty. But yesterday, before the concert, I went to the mall. I'm sorry I didn't record. I always do that. But the mall was really, really packed. But I'm going to show you guys what I got. First, I'm going to show you guys my mom's stuff. What I got my mom and what my sister got my mom. So, my sister bought my mom these shoes for Christmas. But I think my sister just going to give them to my mom early so my mom can start wearing them now and you know just count it as a present and then around christmas time shop and then put stuff up because y'all know how my mom is she be like well you can just put it up for christmas like girl no so mom got these shoes they're super freaking cute so we've been trying to collect i got last year for christmas i got my mom some purple and white air max and then this year for christmas my sister got my mom these ones and last year for christmas my sister got my mom black ones that are just like this we always give my mom shoes as a gift because one thing about my mama she does not like spending like big excessive money on herself so like these were like 160 or 140 i think and she would not have paid that for herself if it was me or my sister she would have but for herself she would not so we just always have to get her shoes um for christmas i think i might get her some air force ones because she really loves her air force ones and i seen yesterday the nike outlet the nike outlet has air force ones in like stock in her size so i think we're just gonna get her some air force ones for christmas i mean i think i'm going to so then yesterday i got her these socks there's some air apostle peanut socks you got on my mom well, y'all don't, but my mom loves the Peanuts movie. Every year for Christmas, it's a tradition that we have to watch the Peanuts movie. These came from Air Postal. They were $15. I got her those. I got her this bracelet. It's um, it's from Hobby Lobby. She, when we was in Hobby Lobby, she said, oh, this is so cute. I really would like this. And then when she walked away, I picked it up because it is cute. And she could wear this for like Christmas or when she goes into her job and looks professional. I told her to pick out some panties at Pink. She told me she couldn't find no panties that she liked. So, I just got her these. Um, these are the only ones she literally picked out. So, I just got her these ones. They just say pink at the top. My mom don't really like this type of style underwear. She likes a different style. But, yeah. She got these ones. They're super cute, though. I I'm hoping she'll pick out more before Christmas. And I'll get her some more. But I'm going to give her all of this stuff early because there's no point for her to wait for Christmas. Like, she knows it's a gift. You know what I mean? Anything anybody buys somebody in the house, we know it's a gift for Christmas. So, if we give them to them early, you know what I mean? But, yeah. My mom's not giving us stuff early. She bought me a black Nike jacket, a pink Nike hoodie, and some black Nike jogging pants. But she's not giving it to me early. She's putting it up for Christmas. So, the next we got... I got my mom, me and my sister both got this. It's just a Nike shirt. It's super freaking cute. We're trying to get my mom more Nike shirts. This one was $20. It's a men's extra large because she does not like short arms. So, 
we think this is gonna really cute with her shoes just due to the purple so it's giving i also got her a pink nike shirt but it's in her room and i'm not going in there to get it because she's sleeping but it looks just like that and it says just do it in white and it's light pink and it'll match her air force ones perfectly so y'all know how we get down me and my sister we don't play when it comes to our mama we don't play so then i got her this lavender purple shirt um my mom really she does wear plain shirts but she does wear like a lot of nike and like adidas and stuff but i just got her this plain shirt for like on a plain day if she's just running to walmart and wants to throw on her purple shoes and a purple shirt so i got her this purple shirt to match her shoes because mama doesn't really have a lot of colors so me and my sister are trying to get more colors into her wardrobe um so that was everything that we got her yesterday yeah that was everything we got her yesterday she could have had these Adidas pants, but they're medium. So I know she's not going to want to wear those. So I'm just going to sell them, I guess. Okay, so we're going to go along with the socks. Oh, yeah, I got her these. These are from American Eagle. Y'all know we're wearing Grinch pajamas this year, so we have to match the theme with the Grinch socks. When we take family pictures, it just has to match. So me and my moms, these are Tay's. And my sisters are gray just like this, but they're like look a little different so because she didn't want to wear these ones but me and my mom got these ones so christmas socks on deck i got all of our christmas pajamas too this year so we already got those next we're gonna go with panties um i know every time a girl goes shopping she has to get these so i got these from victoria's secret they just like have little what the hell are them called candy canes with a bow little candy canes with a bow a little thong action and then they had these ones. I've never seen the ones with the little rhinestone right here that says Victoria's Secret. So I had to pick these up. They're thongs as well. They didn't have this kind of regular panties. And then they had these ones with the little thong action. Really cute. I got five pair of panties. And then I just got two pair of these kind. Because I've been wearing these kind a lot. But they say pink at the top. So I got these two that say Victoria's Secret. yeah them are all the underwear i got i just literally went underwear shopping last week too and got five pairs so i'm really stocking up on the underwear okay so next i went to adidas i don't wear adidas but i think i'm gonna start wearing adidas so on the hanger it says a large right why the fuck did i get a large why did i get a large you know what I really am going to do? I think I'm just going to take them back. And I'm just going to um, ask to exchange for the next size. I'm just going to ask my mom to do it for me. Because, you know, she'll do it for me. I'll just ask her to go in there and then ask them. Just tell them, like, you bought the wrong size for your, your freaking kid or something. I don't freaking know. Because I don't want to take them back, y'all. I, I hate taking stuff back. I get nervous. I don't know. I was just going to sell them and then get Taylor the right size, but I get too nervous taking things back. But yeah, I got to take these before I noticed they were a medium and not a large. He can't wear a medium, y'all. He can fit a medium, but in the length, it's entire too, entirely too short. He is a long motherfucker. So I got him these. And I got myself these ones. We were supposed to be matching. That's why I said we need to, I need to take his back. Um... And yeah, we just got some Adidas pants. Y'all know it's getting cold as fuck outside, so it's that time for them type of things. Next, my cousin gave me these. They're from Amber Amber Crombie and Fitch. I've never shopped at Amber Crombie. Yeah, I never shopped there. But my my cousin gave me and Tate these shirts. They just say they're brand new, both of them. They just say like. Uh, 1988 Cincinnati Bengals and it's just like got the dates from the Bengals player playing in the, the 1980s and stuff and it like crosses them out the games I think they won or whatever I don't know but me and my my cousin gave me and Tay this shirt so we can match um so we both got this shirt a couple days ago we just still haven't worn them yet I'm leaving the best for the last because I'm so excited that I was able to get this for Tay. 
I don't know. I just love buying him big things because he always buying me shit. Like, bro, y'all don't see it, but Tay buys me whatever I want when I want. Like, I never have to, like, want or need for anything because I know Tay gonna make sure I'm straight if I don't got it. So, this was, like, my way of showing him love and appreciation was through this item that I purchased for him, that I got for him, and I'm really excited about it. But next on the motherfucking agenda is these Nike shirts. So, I got me... Well, this is Tay's. This is Tay Nike shirt. All the Nike shirts are $20 right now. I guess $5 off. They're originally $25. $5 off ain't no fucking deal. But anyways, this one is for Tay. And this one is for me. I'm going to try it on. I got big ass boobs. So, sometimes 2X Nikes be entirely too tight up here. Like, and then I have to, like, slit them down the middle to get them to, like, fit correctly because my boobs be entirely too big. But me and Tay both got this Nike shirt. Um, if mine don't fit how I want it to fit, I'll just give it to my mom and then go get me a different one or something. Go get me a, a different size. So now we have the last thing. I'm about to show y'all what I'm really excited for, and it's this jacket. If y'all don't know, this jacket is, like, really expensive. Look up the price. The price tag is actually right behind y'all. It's $148 plus tax. It's probably, like, $160. This is a Los Angeles Lakers bomber jacket. Like, what? Like, what? Stop playing. Stop playing, y'all. Los Angeles Lakers. I was able to get this for my man and I was so motherfucking excited. It's a ultra grain game size large. I was so motherfucking excited. Like, y'all don't know. I've been wanting to get Tay either a Bengals bomber or a Lakers bomber. Well, whatever they're called, varsity jackets. I don't know what they're called, but I've been wanting to get Tay either a Lakers or a, ba or a Bengals one just because. Them are his two favorite games. So I was like, for Christmas, I got to go out for a bang and get him a Lakers or a um, Bengals one. I was able to find the Lakers one first. Um, I found it at Aeropostal. They have a whole line of like Lakers and Chicago Bulls. So I was able to get, I was able to cop the jacket. And I was so excited about it. But yeah, y'all, I'm getting ready to get up out of here. I'm getting ready to send all the footage over to the other phone, edit it. I'm going to roll up because it's currently 9.50. Tay has to be to work by 11 o'clock. So, I'm going to put my hair in a ponytail. Roll us a little joint. Tay, are you awake? Tay's not awake. I was going to have him tell y'all how he liked the concert but he's not awake so maybe in the next video he could tell y'all what he thought about it but i ain't gonna lie i know tay loved it because he wanted to go there he wanted to go there and also me and tay popped out on the internet yesterday not on his page but on my page um let me show y'all the video y'all might think like bitch popped out on the internet y'all do youtube but no ho I mean, like, pop it on in there. Oh, yeah, these are the shoes I was going to get his son yesterday. I was going to get him both of them. Them are fire as fuck. For Christmas, like, who don't want hella shoes for Christmas? Tay, tell the gang how you, um, how you feel about that concert. You don't have to, like, get in the camera. Just use your voice. Oh, he looked like he had a good time. Y'all can't see him, but he looked like he had a good time. He real tired. Did you have a good time, babe? You had a good time. Who was your Who was your favorite uh, rapper? Juvenile. Juvenile was his favorite rapper, y'all. Look up the legend of hip hop, y'all. Let's see, like everybody that was there, but like it was a lot of people. But Juvenile was his favorite. I would say personally, like I liked all of them. They all had good music. None of the music was like ass or nothing. They all had good music. It was a vibe. Like you could just sit there and just. Dance around, smoke your joints, and, like, just chill. So, it was a vibe. It was fun. I would say it was less lot, like, lots less traffic than Moneybag Yo. Moneybag Yo was, like, really, really 
packed. Like when we was going up the steps, it was hard to even get in the steps. This time it wasn't really hard. And going up and down the steps was making me nervous because them steps are steep. But I took a lot of pictures. I insert them and for you guys, we took a lot of videos. Um, what else? Like I was taking videos of just Tay, because you know these are memories. Like we love going to concert, y'all. If you have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. If you have a boyfriend or girlfriend, make sure y'all get out and do stuff. Because, like, me and Tay, we, I feel like we started getting comfortable with each other. And we stopped going on, like, we would go to the movies. We used to go to the movies every single Tuesday as a date. But, like, the movies is nothing. And we're both not club people. We don't care to go to the club. So, we started going to the casino every so often, having fun. And then every concert that, like, we like or, like, the people we know we're gonna start going and i think y'all should start doing the same like if you and your partners are trying to find other things to do with each other go to a concert i promise you it opens up like uh your eyes to like dang why haven't me and my man been doing this a long time y'all know me and tay have been with each other for five almost five years in february it will be five years and i promise you this year we went to three concerts right we went to three concerts this year and it's just like it feels so amazing like it's so fun to just go have fun with your partner or whoever and i don't know we just really like it we're not club people so sitting in a concert enjoying music no drama that's me and tay's type of vibe so i will be on ticketmaster even though i got a bone to pick with motherfucking ticketmaster Anyways, I will be on Ticketmaster, like, trying to see what other concerts will be coming in Cincinnati. Um, I do want Tay to go to a hockey game because he's never been. Hockey's not for everybody, but it's honestly funny watching them just all bash each other in the fucking wall. And the hockey games is at the same place that the concerts is at. Um, so, yeah, I want to go to a hockey game. I want to go to a basketball game. I definitely want to go to a football game. If I don't make it to a football game this year, next season, definitely. Well, we might as well not even go this season. Because Joe Burrow not in. So, we might as well just wait to next season to go, y'all. Because Tay's favorite player, Joe Burrow, is not there. So. But, yeah, we love y'all. We'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell to be notified every time I post another video. Back to back, just like this one. It might be a little different. You never know what you're going to do on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.